was the worst time of his life. Oh yeah, he wrote it in his there, book. Yeah, the he, worst, oh, he worst was like, five minutes of his life. The worst. <laughs> worst thirty seconds he ever went through. Really? You got a book out of it. I know. I mean, I know. You can't really, you know. And actually, it was riveting. It ri- it was, but he he ripped all of you. Well, uh, it is um it is terrifying to be on that show. <laughs> Oh, he ripped us? Oh, let me say this You don't even remember him, do you? You have no idea. I'm not talking Jay Moore, and this is in his book, but this was funny. (laughs) He's like, aha, you have read the book. No, yeah, I read the book. But I'm saying I'm not saying anything out of school because he wrote it in his book. But Jay Moore Moore did a sketch called Good Morning Brooklyn or something like that. He's a funny guy. Whatever, I'm telling the story. He is. (laughs) So he he wrote a, a, he did a (laughs) sketch, he wrote a sketch called Good Morning Brooklyn with Marissa Tomei or something like that. Mm -hmm. So anyways, something like that, something like that. So anyways, a comic like phoned in and said, you know, I do that in my act, you know. Jay Moore stole that from my act. So the producer, Kenny Amon, he goes, well, listen, guys can get different ideas. You know, you, you you can't prove it. And the guy we goes, well, actually, jokes. I can prove it. <laughs> he sent a tape. Oh, no. And it was the, uh, I saw the tape. It was the most hilarious tape. It's the stand-up comic doing the bit. <laughs> and Jay Moore is in the front row no, laughing. Really? <laughs> no, really? No way. Not the front row. <laughs> so Saturday Night Live. Something like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> the second really? row. I can't imagine comics Something just sitting less in the front row. So Saturday Night Live had to pay this guy. Wow. It's in the book, <laughs> so. That's I hilarious. didn't know it was in the book. Did he That's ever good. admit to taking it, or? Yeah, it's in the book. It's in his book. He, I don't remember that. He had to admit at that point. I don't know. like to read those SNL books. You know, every time you turn the page, you think something's bad is going to be said about hate, you. And it's yeah, always yeah. like they say they hate women, but I mean, Tina Fey is all on there all the time. They don't She's hate like the, they don't No, hate it's so, Lauren Michaels loves women. No, every Valentine's Day, he sends like a rose <laughs> to every woman. Remember that? Yes, he did. Yeah. Each did he woman really? on the cast would get a nice long stem is rose. Is that true? Yeah. That's the guys nice. would get crap. Who were yeah. the women on the show when you were guys? Who the hell knows well, who they were? Yeah. Well, who, who, who? Ke- Kevin had who now? very uh, talented women during this time. They all, Jan Hooks, all together. Nora Dunn, oh, Victoria I Jackson. Her, yeah. I was actually That's dating funny. Jan Hooks at the, time, the first were year. Were you really? Yeah. I didn't know that. So yeah, he probably she? had, they were probably the most talented women. You and Jan Hooks were getting, getting to know this is interesting. You and Jan Hooks were getting I didn't say we're getting on. I said we're dating. Oh, yeah. All right. So you're getting nothing. Kevin Nealon actually... Had a, a chance to uh, date Jennifer Aniston. At one did time. you really? It was just like three months. I didn't know that. Yeah, we did a short film together. What what film? I don't remember. What are you talking about? No, <laughs> Lynn was a leprechaun. I'm saying, She's not remember, you lived in New York and she was a hostess. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, I never yeah. dated her. What happened was uh, when I first got on the show, there was this uh, restaurant around the corner around my house, right. and and um, there was this really cute hostess in there. It was just a little hamburger place, mm-hmm. and I would go in there and. The food wasn't really that great, but I just loved seeing her and looking at her. Is Jennifer Aniston? This is in 86 or 87. Wow. And um, and then she left. I didn't see her for a long time. And then I uh, run into Jennifer Aniston, like, you know, 10 years later. And she goes, you used to come into the restaurant I was hostess at a lot. Before no I, way! You know, this before she got into show business. And I said, really? Which one? And she goes, and she named the restaurant. I thought, wow. See that? That's good. See, That's a good story. powerful man. Good story. So he could have asked her out. He I could have. have. He was on he, TV. He could have. He mm-hmm. didn't. One time I was on the show and <clears throat> Jewel was on the show. Nice. Oh, with her crazy teeth? Yeah, but yeah. I, I yeah, that's well, what everyone I, knows I her for. Her. Yeah, I, I love know, her the jacked crazy up teeth. teeth. No, you really? You yeah, like because, the jacked up teeth? Because I find it like cute and like she's just my <laughs> perfect not. type of girl. I really like yeah, Jewel. She's, she's top. So I go to the. Uh, I'm at the show, right? And. Uh, and I'm like, oh man, I'm going to meet Jewel. So she comes out running out. She goes, Norm. Oh. She goes, she hugs me. She goes, I have the biggest crush on you, right? And I'm, so I'm in like shock, you know? And she's like, uh, are you going to go to the after party? So then I'm like playing it cool. I'm like, yeah, maybe, you know? <laughs> but, like, uh, and in reality, you're the first one there every week. Yeah. <laughs> so, like, uh, so for the whole show, I'm just like playing it cool and everything. And she's like, you're going to come, right? Like, yeah, yeah I'm, uh, I'll probably be there. You know? So, but meanwhile, I'm like, I can't wait for the show to go over and be over and <clears throat> go there and, uh, you know, uh, and, uh, you know, Mary Jewel and everything like that. You know, I was all super happy. So then I go to the after party, super right? Happy. I go to the after party and I show up late, you know, because nice, I feel like nice. Keep the after waiting. party. And keep here's Jewel sitting sure. all alone in this booth, you know. So Would I come, it. I sit down, talking to her in the booth. All of a sudden, like a French dude shows up, right? And she's like, oh, this is uh, Pierre, whatever the hell. They start necking. Pierre, whatever the hell. Wow. They start, they start Pierre, whatever the hell. 
So oh. this whole time she was setting you up. She you come to the after party. She's playing you. She's she, playing she had a you, boyfriend. Dog. She was she was kissing. She's playing you. So I was like, uh, oh man. <laughs> Michael. No, I don't think she was playing me. I think she really did like me. And so then, but then, but then she was. So this would have been the man. smart play, right? Right. To be cool and nice and everything because, you know, when she broke up with a French guy, then I'd have a chance. But instead, I'm making all these anti-French comments and being a, being a dick and then she doesn't like me. And then, and then her, you know, she busted up with a French guy and married a cowboy. And, <laughs> married a cowboy. <laughs> now, she did too, right? She did you did. have, who did you have the biggest crush on that hosted? Cowboys? The biggest crush on that hosted? Yeah. Besides John right. Goodman. Wait, we have, wait, 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 we have a guest she for you. Yeah, she people cuts want off to talk the to joke. Will you discuss, please? Allison, you're on 106.9. Free Family. Oh. Joke. Yeah. Darren O'Toole, yeah. Norm MacDonald, and uh, Kevin, Kevin Nealon, who, by the way, is playing at Cobbs tonight. You hey, dude. See him. Hello. Hey. There, there's the boys. I just wanted to, uh, well, first off, I want to say, Norm, I think you're like the funniest yes. in the world. <laughs> yes, I agree. Insanely I agree. funny. And I like me and all my friends completely worship you. Ah, uh, that's nice. Are you, are you playing in San Francisco? Kevin who? They have French Kevin boyfriends. Who now? We're playing in San Jose. Hmm. He's at the San Jose. She doesn't pub. like you enough to drive the hour, but they <laughs> <laughs> love you. Yeah. Kevin, Biggest fan. Kevin, oh, Kevin Nealon is yeah. tonight at Cobb. Just like half the show. When are the shows? I do a good Norm McDonald impression both. at Cobb. You know, Cobbs you could do like an San early Francisco. show with Norm and a late show with Kevin. You could do that. Oh, Kevin, where are you playing? Right here in Co at Cobb's in San Francisco. There you are. Right in Columbus. And we just lost. Still nothing. <laughs> we just lost tickets there. Still nothing. <laughs> Five minutes too far to drive. Yeah. <laughs> anything in my anything, anything in my, my family house? room? Yeah. What's that? Yeah. Nothing. Doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> Darren's just lost control of the show completely. Totally. <laughs> but, yeah, I just giggled. But, but uh, you know, That's I'll, do, I'll do. do San Francisco at some point. Oh, Eduardo. San Rafael. Hello, Hello Eduardo. Hello. She cuts everyone off. Hey, Norm. How you guys doing? Good. How are you guys? How are you, Eduardo? I don't cut everyone yeah. off. I'm at some point, they have to go. Morning. I'm totally on GURP. I'm hammered. You're what? But I had to. I'm, I'm on GURP. What's GURP? Uh, like drinking Cisco and Carlo Rossi. Oh yeah, sure. What does that mean? Frog, yeah, yeah. What does that mean? It's like Thunderbird. You know, I, oh. I want to come oh, to you guys tonight. What time are you guys going on? Uh, <laughs> We're not together. Cobbs. Uh, I'm I'm on Kevin Nealon's on a Cobbs probably <laughs> about them. nine o'clock. Cobbs 15. nine o'clock. Okay, okay. Is that East Coast time? Wait, <laughs> that's GURP time. <laughs> it's, <laughs> it's always GURP time, my friend. I'm looking at my Gucci right now. Are you Canadian? Yeah. I got to say, I, I'm going to go see uh, Gilbert Godfrey. And, oh, uh, he's coming in, too, next week. He's coming in next week. <laughs> next week? He is. He really okay. is. Let's live in the moment. Why are you laughing? Why are you laughing at that? That's funny. He's a good guy. No, he is. I like I Gilbert. Like, I, I like those guys. Uh, I like Ernest P. Worrell a lot. What? Uh, I don't know who that is. Oh, you're talking that? about from Andy Griffith show? No, no. Ernest, Ernest, Ernest goes, goes to camp. <laughs> but he's dead. He's you can't dead. see Isn't him anywhere. Dead? Vern? Vern, can, can Vern he's, he's dead. No, movie? he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. What did you say? You cut him off because <laughs> Ernest is dead? Never <laughs> so who did you have a crush on? Uh, what Daniel. guest host? Jim Varney. What guest host? Wait, Daniel. Wait, Daniel. Wait, hello. It's my show. I never Daniel. Said Dolly Parton, but I love Dolly Parton. I've lost Parton. complete control awesome. of this program. <laughs> Daniel she in Vallejo. Hitting, you're on the Darian O'Toole like show. She's with, uh, <laughs> seems like <you> she's <laughs> did seem that hello. way. That's what I've heard about. One zero six nine free FM. Yeah. Good luck. Who are, you, who are you talking to? I'm talking to Daniel. I don't know what the hell <laughs> you're talking to. Norm, how's it going? Good, man. Um, are you coming back to the Bay Area anytime <laughs> soon? Because I live Does in the North Bay, to and Kevin? I can't go see you in San Jose. And it'd be a cool birthday present, because my birthday is tomorrow, but I can't go. How about a clock radio instead? <laughs> no. <laughs> and you guys radio? really were the funniest guys on Saturday Night Live. Have you, ever seen, have you ever so, seen Kevin stand up? Uh, I've seen He's him very stand funny. up, but He's I've very funny. seen him do his stand up. His stand-up is funny. unbelievably, unbelievably good. It funny. Is. It's true. That's true. Oh, yeah. Uh, Norm, did you lose any big money? Oh, <laughs> also, that's what I wanted to know. Nobody listens Kevin, on your... we're really trying. I quit, Even... I quit sports gambling. Oh, did you? don't lie, Norm. You I... don't have to lie on the radio. No, I did. I lost a tremendous amount of money on it, and I finally gave it up. <laughs> I play poker, though. Oh, oh I love <laughs> poker. No, are you coming back to the Bay Area anytime soon and not playing San Jose? Uh, not playing San Jose. Yeah, I'm, doing, like yeah, I'm, coming, to, I'm coming to San Francisco in a I'm few months. I'm cutting him off, by the way. See? I, see how I roll? That's how I roll. That's how I roll. What kind I'm of done. poker do you play, Noah? No Limit? No Limit? 
All right. He plays the money with, uh, the you know what? Four I, times as long as they want to stay, yeah. I'm letting them because they're funny boys. Kevin night. Nealon wow. and Norm McDonald, 1069 FM. <laughs> Darian O'Toole, middays 10 to 2 on 1069 Free FM. <laughs>